This episode is sponsored by Josie Mikes. Let's get into it. Let me treat this out real quick, chat. Let me treat it out real quick. Okay, dismiss. Let's go, let's go. Bam. Bam. Okay. Discord, hold on. Hold on, chat. Episode Okay, hold on chat. Hold on chat. Just so Okay. <clears throat> Alright, we all here, we're live. Alright, let's get it. A manager checks in with his ball club. Okay. Hold on, chat. Oh, fuck. Alright, bullpen. Hold on. Uh, guys, make sure chat can heal me. Hold on. Hold on, chat. I know I'm streaming late. I know, I know, I know. But I'm here. Okay. Yeah, sorry about that. I'm, I'm here. That's all that matters. Alright. Alright, hold on, chat. Sorry, chat. I'm. Go to the show. Yeah, yeah, yeah. USA. Yep. English. Uh, uh, we should be good now. We should be good now. Everybody, if you want, if you don't mind, you can refresh. You can refresh. You can refresh. Live from the north side of Chicago, Wrigley Field, uh, MLB The Show has action out of the NL Central. It's the Cincinnati Reds and the Chicago I'm Cubs. I'm here. Joined by my partner, Chris I'm Singleton. Here, that's all I'm John Chambi. And this should be a great one, Chris. First place against second place. Two teams. Right there we go. Fourth place against second place. Race. Absolutely, Boog. The race for this division is tied, and these two teams look like they're going to battle oh, the, the rest of the, the season. Oh, the Leafs lost. Who's the best is there a clear advantage between the two? Well, the best way to find out is having them go head-to-head, -head, and that's exactly what we get in this one. Just a little bit away from first pitch. Damn, everybody's out on everybody's out the next lefty, game. Avery Lynch. Chris, his strikeout rate this year among the best all time. 
He's truly one of the elite strikeout pitchers Let's in go. the league. I mean, strikeouts per nine off the chart. So the opposing team, they know they have the work cut out for them anytime they're facing this guy or a guy like this that's going to get the swings and misses. Pretty much in a class of his own when it comes to that oh, category. Oh, fuck. Hold on. Hold on, hold on, chat. All right, sorry about that, chat. All right, and the pitch, Jay Allen, the batter oh, now as he swings and misses. Jay Allen, we are fucking Jay Allen. It doesn't matter who the LJ Allen is. At the belt and fires. Swing and a miss, and he waves oh, at that good. one. Big time jam right there. I hate it as a hitter. Oh, me was a clean cool shot. Oh, my God. A little bit. He won. Swing, tried to hold up. Now an appeal to first. Let's go. And he couldn't hold back. He's rung up on strikes. He won, baby. Let's go. Here's the shortstop at the play. Noel V. Marte. And he swings and misses, and it's nothing at all. Lynch, the rookie of the year from a year ago, he features a four seam cool. fastball, a changeup, a curve, a slider, and occasionally uses a cutter. Next one misses. Come on, out. Strike. No score just getting started, top of the first. Swing and a miss. That's go. strike two. Ah. In the air, left field. Shit. I got it. I got it. Two down. Let's go. We got it. Here's the lineup for the Reds. And a big factor for them in recent games, Paven Smith. And Boog, he's their team leader Payton home run. Smith. So you know the pitchers on that other side, man, they took a lot of time preparing for him in that pregame meeting. You know, he's got a oh, lot wow. of pop, and it's real pop. It's not fluky at all. He can absolutely change the outlook of a game very quickly. So watch out when he steps in. Now the left fielder, Taylor Here we go, Ward. Here we go. Hey, he plays it first. Taylor Ward. Come back into the mound. Tosses the first, and go. the inning is over. Nice comeback. Come back to the mound and with one, two, them. three. Go the Reds. And now it'll be the Cubs' turn in a scoreless ball game. This is Cubs baseball on the show. Oh, I'm gonna get my heel cut tomorrow too, chat. Got to shape up on the hill and then uh, the north field. side of Chicago. John Chambi and Chris Singleton. And Second inning down. set to go. Eugenio Suarez Ball up one. to the plate now. Big interview, father. No Big interview, father. There's like five people. The pitch. That's both into the AD. Great hitter at the dish. If you're going to miss, you've got to miss outside the zone. You miss inside the strike zone, you'll be asking the umpire for a new baseball. Kicks and fires. And now two and one. Two balls, one strike. You want. There we go. Fought off foul. Woo. Two. And here it comes. Got him swinging. Let's go. Below the knees. Below the fucking knees. And ready to hit now for Cincinnati. Paven Smith. First pitch, and he just ah. misses. No score here in the second. Okay. And it's one and one. one, and one. Right. Carl Dixon doing the umpiring behind the plate. 
Let's Boone, go. I'm not sure if it's because he sort of sets up higher than most, but one thing to be aware of with Dixon is the high strike. Not usually a big deal because most guys are swinging at pitches up there, but we may see some surprise looks from hitters from time to time Ooh. because that's just so unusual. Fans don't really understand the familiarity and relationship players and coaches have with umpires. I mean, you see these guys a lot. Yeah, but these guys are all out there trying there to do go. their best and perform at a high level. So let's you go. Respect that. I think over time you can develop a relationship with some of these guys. Okay. Here's Bobby Dahlbeck. That one the other way. Nope. And it foul. goes just foul. As the game has moved along, we see more and more information supplied by teams about the umpires. I've been in clubhouses where they have pictures of all four guys, nicknames, hometowns, and as well, hobbies got listed. We all got to pause on that thought, as that'll do it for the inning. All right. Reds go down Wave quietly. Wave right for me, man. We'll go to the bottom of the Wave second. Right no score. Welcome back. All set for the start of the inning. In now for Wave Reds, right for Matt me. McClain. Obviously a guy who makes good contact, hits for average. Matt well, one of the things in today's oh, no, game, the oh, value it is. Oh. and the fact that he hits both righties and lefties. Also, the Mets game got postponed. They're so sad. reliant on the matchups nowadays, Chris, and it's huge when you don't have to sit a guy or platoon him. When you can hit you know, both oh, sides in terms of pitcher's arms, you're a guy that it's hard to take out of the lineup, and I think it's very important today when everything is under the microscope. Foul ball there. Oof. That was it. 98. The pitch. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. Let's go. Get him out in front, which isn't easy to do. Nice a hitter like this known for using the entire field. Just couldn't sit back long enough on that one. Drop change up. Now, Hold on, what am, what am I playing at? Oh fuck, I had that from for my Diamond Dynasty. Uh, let me go. Let's go better one. Let's see Matt what better one looks like. He was two for four in Wednesday's game. First pitch, and that's in for a strike. Ooh. Nelson in the eighth if spot. This goes quick, I, if this goes quick, if this goes a good run I'm at the plate, to hitting over three hundred I mean, in his last ten games. And he's down 0-2 as he swings yeah, through. Yeah, I might have to go to all This can be kind of frustrating for the hitting coach. This right pitch. now, this lineup seems to be swinging at everything. Okay, he got it. He got it. He got it. Next one just misses, and it's one and two. Come on. That one missed. Come on, that change up right out of the hand. Just spit on it. Two and two. And a good eye there. Really good take. What? With two strikes. Um. Oh. Hacks and misses. It's a Suck strike. It, man. Get the hell out of here. That last one should have been a strike. Spencer Steer, the next to hit for the Reds. Here. First offering and it just misses. Steer. Yeah, me was five feet show. eleven inches, one hundred and eighty-five pounds, and he was a third-round pick back in twenty nineteen. Ball two. Okay. Two, way now. two outs. And yeah, now two balls and a strike. Uh, two one. And it's fouled away. Top wow. of the third, no score. Inside Perfect. and it hit him. He had two no, strikes it on didn't. him. No, it didn't. And he hit him. Do you uh, have any memorable hit by pitches yourself? No, no it didn't. College? No, but I almost did get decapitated by a foul ball at Old Tiger Stadium. Come on, um. That's awful. 
Allen in the box here. Let's that one go for a ball. That should have hit the battle. Next offering is in for a strike. Here comes a pitch. Fouls one off out of play back to our left. Struck him out with Give me that cash. Shut your mouth. Frozen with a backdoor slider. Squaddle. So one left for Cincinnati, and we are still scoreless. Let's go. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Back here at the ballpark. Come on, man. As we Tony. Go to the top of the I'm floor. locked the in. Will be the shortstop. Noel no Martin. fucking zero zero. I mean, it's pretty cool, Shaw. Lynch back to work. Nope. Ball one, no mm, strikes. That's, uh, well, these Reds just that lacking wasn't discipline it. at the plate in this ball game. So many of their outs have come from weak contact on pitches. They're chasing outside of the strike zone. You can't do much of anything with those locations, and that's been true. Also, this is today. what you free on the ground, right side. You free with the cubby gathers and yeah. throws the first, and a quick out number one. And as a pitcher, when the oh, hitters are swinging at Alvin everything, Vigio. you feel no need to challenge inside the zone. You just keep working the corners and expanding that strike zone and beyond, and they just keep eating go. right out of your hand. All right. Ward batting for the second time, and that's there strike one. The Reds yet to pick up a hit here. Out to short Swanson. Get now the throw to first on the run. You're up. Let's go. Two away. Well, he's one of the best shortstops in the sport, no doubt about it. And he put his That's skills on display right there. once again right there. Great stop on the back end. It was the easy. transfer and throw for me that really stood out. Easy. The Got speed him out. going down the line. There's no way he gets the out go, any other way. That was impressive. Hey, Eugenio Suarez oh, up to him. Oh, down. shit. Hold on. Those. Wait. Basketball started. Hold on. Wait. Basketball, I think, just ended. Hold on. Hold on, chat. Hold the phones. I'm pretty sure it did. Oh, I'd bother and like face out in seconds. Okay. The one oh. There's a strike. There we go. Not bad, chat. Next pitch Whoa, misses. And it's two and one. Even though I'm out with my we might watch my force. Two down, nobody on. Postseason. Here's a high chopper. baseball. Murphy on the first. Um, That's the third out. Reds down in there. order. Still no. Go to karaoke fills there. Here at Wrigley Field, we go to the top of the fifth, and now the right fielder, Paven Smith. And that's in for a strike. Well, these Reds we just start putting together very many good at-bats in this one. Just one base runner to this point, and it's not exactly early anymore. And the, the base one was fucking lineup, ball. Capable of sparking something, but it just hasn't happened for him yet. And the 0-2. Goes down looking. Give me that uh, Well, there's a three-pitch strikeout. He can do whatever he wants with the baseball right now. So up next, oh, Bobby Dahlbeck. Bobby Dalba. In the first pitch misses for ball one. Well, on the mound, very efficient. Able to produce an outcome, it seems like, within the third or fourth pitch of just about every bat. Ah. Next offering upstairs. Let that pitch go too much. One down, base is empty. That one spoiled and Woo! The count got now lucky. And he deals. That one fouled off. Two and two. Two and two. And a pitch. Just missed. 
Yeah, come on, blue. The Reds hitless so far in the game. Oh. And a pitch. Good job to fight that one off. Oh, my God. And oh. there's a rocket into the outfield. So a man aboard now with one away. Oh, man. But when you see that many pitches in it at bat, your chances of succeeding go up. And right there, we see the result. Oh, McClain it swings through it. It for rocketed. Strike one. He's got the power. But great contact skills. One of the best contact hitters oh, yeah. in the game. Next pitch is downstairs. Swing and a miss. He was late. Strike there we two. Go. One, two. With two strikes. May see some movement over there at first base. Try to stay out of a double play here. In there. Give me that K. Down on strikes. Clip the bottom of the zone with a curve for strike three. Give me that K. Next for Cincinnati, Matt Nelson. 0 for 1, he struck out swinging last time. Pitch misses inside, 1 and 0. Nope. Dahlbeck, the runner at first with two gone. Next offering misses, ah. and that's ball two. Two balls, no strike. There's a strike. There we go. Swing and a miss. Uh, two two. Kicks and deals. Swing and a miss. Let's go. And that is that. Come on. Reds leave one, and we're still knotted at zero. All right, we go to the top half of inning number six. Here's a big power threat. Spencer Steer. And a good fastball to start go. him off. Come on. Strike one. There's the strike. That's two. Ah. This guy's seen two changeups in a row. Could be a little vulnerable for a fastball right here. That misses the zone. Now okay. one and two. Knocks that one away, and we'll Watch do out. it again. Bows it off, still one and two. Oh. And a pitch. Battling here as he fouls it away. Now he's desperately looking for that swing and miss. He's going to have to just change speeds a little bit, try to move it around, create just a little Watch bit out. of illusion at the end. Swing and a oh, miss dude. with a strikeout. Off Blue the puddle. Express right by his bat for strike three. Nice little cuddle right there. Nice little cuddle. <laughs> so the batting order turns over, and stepping in is the speedy Jay Allen, who's 0 for 2 with a pair of strikeouts. Uh. Check swing and he held you want, up. You want, you want. The pitch. Now one and one. You want. One strike. It's strike two. That's, now yep. try to bunt for a hit Football. right there, and you two can strike. tell he's trying to get something, anything going offensively.
And a one-two again. Swing and a miss. And that puts him just one K away from 200 on the year. Well, they had a great attack for him tonight. I mean, finding all the holes in his swing and his approach, just frustrating for him up there. You strike out a guy three times in a game, I think that guy's got to go back and really study some video with his hitting coach, figure out how they're beating him, make this adjustment really quick, because word will get around the league in a hurry. And now, Noel V. Marte. Wow. Here we go. Be careful with this guy. He's Open. got power. Strike on the ball. 200. One swing. Marte, 23 years old, and he was born in the Dominican Republic. Ball two. Next offering is down low. Two and oh. Where do you even begin sure. with the talent we've seen from the Dominican Republic? Vladi, Big Papi, Pedro, the list goes on and on. All right. A two out. Two balls and a strike. Here it comes. Hey. Gets the slider two, two. in there for a strike. And now it's three and two. He's done a what? great job getting the first two outs. Want to get this number two hitter, get back in the dugout, and face three, four, five next inning. All right, come on. And yeah, there's ball four. Ah! One of the things about that two out walk, the base runner over at first base is going to have a very aggressive secondary lead. So ball down the line or into the gap, yep will produce a two-out RBI, and those are the best. That is, if you are the offensive side of it. That one fouled off. One-one now. And a foul ball. A one-two. Hey, now. We got two. Hey, now. And a one-two. There goes the runner. Spoils the two-strike pitch, and he'll see another. Ah. One, two now. And he grounds one to the right side. Biggio one, one, one. throws the first in time. And that's there the third go. out. And the quality start, too. Well. Taking over on the mound. Well, you see the ERA very solid, and that doesn't always tell you the whole Let's story. Go. He's been really good so far this year. We walked it off, baby. Come on. And a one-nothing final score here in this one. The Cubs go home we a winner that. for Chris Singleton and win. our entire crew here at MLB The Show. Thanks for stopping by. I'm John Chambi. Talk to you soon. Another. Another dominant start. Six innings, one hit baseball, 11 Ks, one walk, no ones, to W, you won one nothing. What's Col what's a Colshaw do even? Oh you mm. went six. He he four walks. He had four walks. 
I didn't have a walk. No, I didn't have that many walks. Let's go, baby. Oops. Oh shit, and the, and the game ended too. The b-ball basketball game ended as well. Wait, did it end? No, no, the game ended. The game ended. Game ended. Ah. Uh. The game ended. Oh my god. All right. Oh me. Let me, let me message me send this picture my, to my to my boy. Good shit. Do this. Ah, now I'm with my whip. What's the whip looking like? A point. Six four EOA two oh nine ends pitch one forty two My wall is now a five. That's huge. Keep a nine. Wapo nine. Wapo nine. nine. Quality start. Fifteen. Um. I guess twenty two starts. My, what's my overall record? Okay, not too bad. I want more wins though. But I'll me me let me do this message. Mm -hmm. 
Shots out, shots out, black. Picked, picked up. A huge, a good pull. That was, that was big. Wins, not there yet. Ross is not there yet. Listen, I'm trying. I'm trying to get there. What's his record? 9-4. I'm 6 and f I'm 7-4. Welcome. I'm about to get over 200 strikeouts for the first time in my career. I'm getting there. Walks on now. Alright. Uh. Alright. Uh, let's keep on playing. Done yet? So that way, that we're not done yet. Hold on, chat. Let's cut her up. Yes, so. Let's do it. Uh, I'm also trying to... Oh, 16-2, okay. Shots ready. Real lit, chat. Real lit. Hello, baseball fans, uh -huh. and welcome. Baseball comes your way on a Wednesday afternoon. It's the San Francisco Giants and the Chicago Cubs. John Shambi alongside Chris Singleton. So, so. And we got a rubber match on our hands today, partner. Yeah, the final game of a three-game set. They've split the first two, and regardless of how important a series is within the larger picture of the season, it's a game you want to get up for. Every series win feels good, so... Yeah, no, every series you got to get up. In this one. All right, we'll be back to get this one started after this. So just about set now, and starting this one... Avery Lynch singing he's been outstanding and should be fun to watch. Well, when you have a guy that oh, I'm going to check the, the, the uh, leaderboard for the award. I'm going for my 200 strikeout. So far. You hope he can maintain it because if he can, it'll be a nice conversation at the end of the year. All right, ready to go here. Here's the center fielder, Juan Velasmil. That misses the zone, and we are underway. Ah, 
On a line out towards center. Good that. Grabs it on Let's the go. Run. She was locking, yo. Now we take a peek at the Giants lineup. One guy leading the she way offensively for this club right now. Juan Velasmil. And Boog, we're talking about a guy who has great wheels what a name. and puts them to good use. He's the team leader in stolen bases and runs score. Man, using his speed to just get in the scoring position and then just flying home wow. when the guy's behind to put the ball in play. I absolutely love watching him do it because he causes havoc on the base paths. Dives and he can't hang on. He's not getting that. Uh, just eat it. Safe. God damn it, man. Wasn't my fault. I think we'll get digged it out regardless. Nice glitch. Here's Nico Horner. Revenge Horner, a guy you think about with a strong baseball IQ, but just the overall smart. He comes from an educational background. Both of his parents at one time taught at Stanford. Let's go. Look at that. You see it. 2.019 EOA. Features a four yes. seam fastball, a change up, a curve, a slider, and occasionally uses a cut. I'm about to want it this year. I don't think I would want it this year. I don't know. The lefty ready and a 1 1. Good eye right there. Come on. And a strike in there. There we go. Here's a 2-2. Yes. Let's go. And that's his 200th strikeout of there the season. Is. Jake Berger, the next giant my ass off that. Two for eight in the series so far. On the ground to third. It's through for a hit. So they get a man aboard with a one-out single. He needed that one. It's been a tough stretch at the plate lately. That pretty much split the zone down the middle, and those are the ones where you got to make them pay. This is Joey Bart. First if I had made Machado, that would have been an easy play. I had Machado. I think that would have been, been a play. And that's in there at the knees. Rusty Valentine doing the umpiring behind the dish for us. Maybe the best name in the league. <laughs> Yeah, that's a solid one, no doubt. I mean, who's oh, better ass than you? I kind of wonder if Rusty is his actual name or just a nickname. Yeah, no clue. I'm guessing his real name is my ultimate Anyways, guess. Rusty's got a good zone, very good on the corners of the plate, but he'll give pitchers a little bit above the letters and below the knees yeah, yeah. if they're earning it. Damn. Come on, guys. All right. You're a nice bare hand by the bad boy. Swings through that Let's one. It's a strikeout. That's the second out. Just indecisive nice and that at bat. He couldn't come in to nice the slider. Nice slider. Beautiful. Trying to sit in between. Just not able to put yes. the bat on the ball. Come on. Vic Caratini at the plate. Big time power. 
First pitch, just misses. Come on, ball. Did X nope, nope that's too high. Two balls, no strikes to count. Rip to third. They oh, take two. the force out. No, oh, out number out. three. One left for San Francisco. They're down one nothing. Uh, Top half of the third inning. Now batting Jamer Candelario. The pitch. And oh. takes low for ball one. Well, on Come paper, on. it's favorable to have a fairly quick inning here with two of the three hitters he's set to face batting from the left Thank side. You. Same side he throws from. Here's a 1-1. One, one. High in the air, out to right. That's weak. I go, I go. Kepler makes the catch, Let's and there's go. one gone. Let's go. Here's a speed threat. Brett Phillips. Phillips in his seventh season. 30 years old now. And he was a sixth round draft pick. Back in 2012. Long chop. Ah. Uh, how about chop? That's in for a strike. No ball. One strike. Outside corner for That's a strike. Two. And down on strikes. And there's there we two go. away. Gosh, here it is. Hit it. Three pitch strikeout. All fastballs. Go. He's got a lot of confidence in that pitch right now. Whoa. Oh, Back to the leadoff spot of the Giants lineup. One, the last mill digs in now. First offering misses Come on, the ball. The last mill hitting leadoff in today's game, and he was born in Panama. Next pitch off the play. Two balls, no strikes. And now the lefty. Yeah, there's the strike. There we go. Nasty 2-0 slider there for a strike. That tells you he's got a lot of confidence in that pitch. Oh, of course it is. Late swing, foul to the left. Out towards right center field. I got it, I got it. Brings it in Let's with go. a nice running grab. And that ends the inning. Giants go down quietly, and it remains 1-0. And welcome back. Here's Garrett Hampson. The short shot. Here it is. Hampson. Lynch back to work. And that's in for a strike. Pretty rare location right there, right, right down the middle. This guy paints the edges. I'm not sure if you're going to see that pitch again as a hitter. Trying to put his way on. Foul. The 2 That one just misses. It's a good take. In the air, out towards left center. That's you. Racing makes the catch. Good shit. Now it's the second baseman, Nico Horner. Next pitch downstairs. Ball one. one ball. Horner, a guy who grew up in the Bay Area, was a huge fan of those late 80s, early 90s, old oh, days teams with Ricky Henderson and company. And Nico loved getting a chance to not only go he watch won. Oakland play, but also the Thank San Francisco you. Giants. The pitch. Foul ball left side. He'll see another. Next one misses, and the count's even at two. Come on. Got 
Let's go. Just Give me that. The trigger on the fastball right there, and I don't think he was taking it, thinking it might be a called ball or anything. I just think he was flat out frozen. Did not expect that location, in my opinion. Hanniger stands in here, takes ball one low. Come on. Swung on, belted. Fuck. That one back there. And it's into the bleachers, out of here. Mitch Hanniger leaves the yard, and it ties it up. It's 1-1. One, one. Oh, fuck. I just... That's exactly the pitch he was looking for. Crushes it and hits it out of the ballpark. Fuck. Fuck. Jake Berger, the next giant to hit. And he's already singled in this game. And fouled off. Ball no, one low. Come on. They tried to get him to chase on a slider down and away. And yeah, a two one hammered, but foul. Look out. That ball was smoked. Man, I am so relieved that they have this netting down the lines. Just ensure safety for the fans. Nice thing as a player you want to look at and see a fan get hit. He's got it. That is the inning. One hit in the inning. <sighs> On the north side of Chicago, John Chambi and Chris Singleton. New inning getting started. Now it's the Giants catcher, Joey Bart. Here comes a pitch. And that one a little bit high. Damn it, Chase. Well, it's been a very impressive outing so far. His command has been count. a big it's part of it. Even three. when he misses, he misses outside the strike zone, which is exactly what the pitcher wants. And now it's one and two. Fights it off, you'll see another. Ah. One and two now. Lifted in the air. He's under That's it. That's weak. Pulls it down and he makes the catch. One away. And here's right. the first baseman, Victor Caratini. Go now. Let's go. That one's in there, 0 and 1. There we go. 0 1. And that's oh. outside. Kicks and fires. Swing and a miss. There we go. Late. I think he was sitting off speed there. And a swing let's go, and a miss. Let's go. And now two gone. Let's go. Jamer Candelario getting ready to hit. There's a strike. Next offering is foul back. All right. The pitch. Oh. Oh. 2 fastball way out of the zone. I think he's trying to speed him off. Got to stay back. Off speed's probably coming. And a swing nope. and a miss. And good work there Fast as he gets a day. one, two, three. Giants down in order. And our score remains 2-1. Let's go. Back here at Wrigley Field, top six. Here's the left fielder, Brett Phillips. And what ball up. one. Mm. All these Giants need to bring up the quality of their at bats and specifically their swings. Just one extra base hit. There we go. Them, so one they ball. haven't exactly been hitting the ball gap to gap or out of the park. 
that makes it really difficult to generate runs. Popped up to the left, into foul ground. Got the Peterson tracks it down for the out. Well, that was a pitch you got to crush. Let's go. Unbelievable that he missed it right there. I'm telling you, he is going to be frustrated with himself until his next at bat. One, the last mill, the next giant to hit. We got one. And the first pitch misses for ball one. Here we go now. Let's go. Next pitch misses outside. Two and oh. One down, base is empty. Just missed. A rare three ball count here. He's been throwing strikes all day. Got to be ready to hit if you're in the box. There's a strike. There we go. Left hand hitter waits. And that one is lifted in the air. Get that. Rotor racing over to make the catch. Now the number Hampson. two hitter, Garrett Hampson, one for two. And yeah, that's in there for strike there one. We go. It really looks like these hitters have been in between with their timing today. Good fastball, excellent slider. Oh, oh nice change up. To commit to one velocity and stay there. The pitch. Got him looking. Let's go. Picks up strikeout number seven. So they make short work of a Seven Ks, baby. Six, seven, eight, two in the bottom of the six. It's the, it's the. We go to the top of the seventh, and now Nico Horner. Lynch back to work. Hey. Some guys are just more confident. They can track that first pitch out of the hand of the pitcher. They don't care if they fall behind 0 1. That's off the mark, and that is ball one. Ah, oops, didn't mean for that pitch. Oh. Falling behind two yeah. and one. Didn't mean for that. And that one lifted in the Get air that. center field. Dansby, Dansby. No trouble here, puts it away for the out. One up, one down. That's a really nice play, ranging back into the outfield for that catch. We all know. Those could be a little tricky, especially if the wind's swirling around out there. Now batting Mitch Hanniger. Yeah, He's already here. homered in this game. Huh. In there for strike one. Oh. Oh, one. Oh. Now he catches the corner for a strike. All right, there now you he may have not liked either of those first two pitches or agreed with the umpire's calls, but at this point, He's going to have to bear down and be ready to hit anything close to the zone. One ball. Oh. Next pitch is in the dirt, and the count is one and two. Next offering is fouled back. Really uh. great change of speeds. He goes off the off speed to the fastball, and the hitter doesn't know what's coming next. Let's go. Outside. It's a strikeout. Definitely made him chase a little bit out of the zone right there. I don't think that's a strike if he takes it. Pretty textbook pitching. Get ahead in the count. Get the guy in the box on his heels. And then force Let's him to go. chase your pitch where he doesn't have much of a chance to do any damage. Boy. And now the DH, Jake Berger. To third, Peterson. Oh, give me that. Gets it to first. And that Save is that. Pitches. Giants are down one, two, three. Score holds. It's Let's three. Go, baby. So they bring on the veteran, Dominic Leon. And we all know about his slider. It's uh, just filthy, man. And one of the better ones in the game, I'd say. Spin rate's uh, very high, and it just breaks it down. Yes. Well, we've seen him close out so many games in his career, so nobody's surprised yes, to see him uh, collect this yes. save. It's a special one, no doubt. Save number 150 is in the books. And your Let's final. Go. No, no, no. I got when so the eight. Cubs celebrate at the plate. For Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show, I'm John Shambi. We'll see you soon. Let's go.
first for the victorious Chicago Cubs. Four runs on eight hits. No errors. They left eight men on base. For the Cubs, two runs, six hits. No errors. They left two men on base. All right. Cubs win. Uh, four. Two against the Giants. Fucking W. Seven innings. Three hits. Eight Ks. No walks. One on one. Eight and four, baby. Eight fucking wins. Let's go. I had to check what I in the Cy Young uh, conversation. Go ahead, 205. Whip. 7-2. Whip percentage finally changes. Twenty four starts, sixteen quality. What else? Oh, my water five two now. A four eight, capo nine. Six as well, got 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 fixed as well. Yeah, wards. Look at that, Sion. I I one nine two last season. Now I'm finally at all. Oh. Shit. No, I'm falling at eight wins, but everybody else is a bum beyond. Uh, 16 home ones. Two, that that put that five two. 
Yeah, yeah. Ah, I did. I did a double check. I was like, wait, did I put that at 5 2? I didn't know if I did. Alright, I think I'm going to do one more, one more start. One more start. I'll do three starts. Yeah, I do three starts. Fuck it. A player receives a check in from one of his coaches. Uh, control. Yeah, I can get, I get, get that stamina up. Look at me go. Oh fuck, what does it do? Welcome in, everybody. Glad you're with us. Major League Baseball on tap. It's the Chicago Cubs and the Arizona Diamondbacks. And now, your 2020. First pitch coming your way next. It was all done, though. So almost ready to get underway and starting in this one, Ryan Nelson. Chris, how about a scouting report? Well, it hasn't been a great year so far in terms oh, of shit, one of Arizona. some decent games and there have been some flashes of greatness, if you will. We'll see today if he's able to get ahead of hitters and perhaps get some swings and misses, put himself in a position Fuck to yeah. bring that ERA down because you know in the back of his mind, beyond the W, he wants to have a better earned run average. The pitch. Josh Rojas. Ball, that's up. The next to hit takes ball one. Damn. This to center field. It's up. Ortega puts it away for the out. And there's one down. Time to take a look at the Diamondbacks lineup. Oh, yeah, I've got to have Otani. He's on that big ass deal. Average for this squad. They're down towards the bottom of the league in total hits and singing. He's on that big ass deal. I think I'm going to do what Michael does. So yeah, after my like, five years, I think I'm going to sign this one year deal. If they're going to be deal. dangerous, if they're going to be able to create scoring opportunities, they're going to have to start making some individual adjustments. A lot of players in this signed. lineup probably aren't happy with how they've hit the ball so far. So today's a chance to get something. Oh, I might go. I might do one year, but I might do a. Uh, Jake McCarthy. Oh, yeah. One year. One down. Takes a strike. In the play, in the play. Uh, can I do that in this game? I don't think you can do that. Hard grounder into the outfield for a knock. Damn. Well, the last 10 games or so have been anything but fun at the plate for him. So that uh, one has to feel good. There was nothing cheap about the way he got that one through the infield. The ball, that was down. ripped. Caught out in front and didn't get under it like he would have liked, but definitely one put out, a good swing out. on it. And now let's see if they force some action with good wheels on the bases. And it's even up. One and one. This is one of those situations the infielders right. have to pre-plan and understand that the ball's got to be hit extremely hard right at them if they're going to have a chance to go for a double play. Left-hand batter waits. 
edge of the zone for a strike. Let's go. And the count one and two. Next pitch has popped up. Oh my God. tosses the mask, settles under it, but it's the pitcher that makes the play. And there are two down. I got it. I got it. Come on, man. I got it, man. I got it. Come on. I got it. Your boy got it. Osco Hernandez. Next offering is down. Oh, no, I'm excited for this. And it's one and oh. So for this job opportunity, what's the job interview? Two outs. Now one and one. One and one. The next pitch that misses. Miss, that's the ball. Two and one. Come on. Kicks and deals. There's yeah. a strike. There we go. Struck him out swinging. Let's go. Cheese for strike three. One left for the Diamondbacks. Scoreless after one. Back here at Chase Field, bottom of the second. All Brandon right. Drury to the plate and the pitch. What? That's through there for a strike. There we go. Lynch, the former rookie of the year, he features a four seam fastball, a changeup, a curve, a slider, and Not occasionally easy. uses a cutter. Biggio sends it to first. One up, one down. Let's go. Tell Marte up to the plate. This guy with big time power and an elite defender. And that one oh gets down God. fair ball. So a man aboard now with one away. Well, that started and ended pretty quickly. No messing around right there. Nice line drive to the full side. Met it out front, but just stayed through it nice enough and ripped it into the outfield. Damn, Gabriel trip. Moreno in the box with one away as he takes ball one. Ripped, and this one could be extra bases. Marte. No, a fucking run too. For third. Marte headed for the plate. He'll score eat it, easily. Eat it, eat it. It's it to the Well, the strike Fuck. first as he gets the job done to bring home the run. Nice line drive to the pole side right there. Uh, he didn't spin off of it. That's the key. You still have to extend through the oh. baseball in order to hit a line drive like that. Cesar Hernandez, the next to hit, takes outside. The switch hitter batting right. He was late there, strike one. one. There we go. Our plate umpire, Earl Hendricks. One down, one down. Yeah, with Hendricks, boo, kind of interesting. He's a good, consistent umpire, but you do hear that he kind of favors one side of the plate more than the other. So uh, it's really hard to know for sure, but I think that usually it has to do something with where he sets up prior to each pitch. Next offering no, misses, and yeah, that's ball two. Singing what kind of strike zone is most frustrating for hitters? I'd say off the plate, away and down and why those are the toughest locations to hit the baseball line to right and that'll be a base hit they won't risk the send runners at the corners now with one away well his hot hitting wow. continues he's been getting great results lately anytime you rip a line drive the other way you feel really good about David. what you did nope. play. you trusted your hands you let the ball travel and you took the ball straight to it that's great work right there and the 1-0 -oh. now he can't squeeze it behind the plate nothing happening on the base only four you only four times eat it first and third one down all right Next pitch misses, and that's ball three. three and, oh. and they're all ball loaded four. up. His ability to draw walks has been something right. that's been part of his career since day one. Rojas in the box now, takes strike one. No and one. Base is loaded, one away. Ball one One there. One At the dish, looking to lift the ball in the air in this spot. Anything but the inning-inning double play, Boo. 
And a swing and a miss there. One, two, oh, come on. really sells the changeup with that arm action. On the ground to the left. And he grabs it in foul ground. Oh. Well, this is a good time to step out of the box, take a deep breath, reset. A couple of changeups. Probably won't see another one here. Go. Got him. Huge strike out there. Next up for the Diamondbacks, Jake McCarthy. Single to right in his first trip. And delivers outside. Next offering is in for a strike. Right, come on. Base is loaded, two down. Take the easy way, force everywhere. Gonna count one and two. One and two. Really going after him here. All fastballs to get ahead in the count. Got him. Let's go. Good job at damage control right there. So they get one, but end up leaving the bases. Bottom of the inning. Here's Shohei Otani. The designated hitter. And here it comes. Pitches in there. That's strike one. Otani measures six feet four inches. Hitting third in the lineup. And he's a former rookie of the year. Hey, here we go. No outs now. Next offering is in for a strike. A one-two count. All he's seen is fastballs. You've got to expect something off speed. Stay back. Next two offering two. in the dirt. Oh. It's two and two. And a pitch. Hard hit to third. Sends it across the first. One up, one down. And now Teoscar Hernandez. And there's the strike. No Hernandez, a former All-Star, 32 years old, and, and he away, was born away. in the Dominican Republic. The old uh. one. And that one fouled off. Where do you even begin with the talent we've well, seen from the Dominican Republic? Right Vladi, Big Poppy, Pedro, the list goes on and uh, on. The 0 2. And now 1, one and 2. Strike. Next ball. one misses. Fuck. Two balls, two strikes. And a pitch. Popped up for a go get that. I got it, I got it. He's there. He's got it. And there are two outs. That was a good pitch to hit right down the heart of the plate. Had pretty good timing on it. Just got underneath it a little bit and popped it up. And now the first baseman, Brandon Drury. 0 for 1 so far. First pitch, and that's in for a strike. There's the swing and a miss. Yeah. He finds himself in a tough situation early. Just going to try to simplify it. Take a knock the other way if you can. That misses. One, two. One and two to count. Come on. I don't think he was trying to miss by that much in an 0 2 count. Just tried to overthrow that pitch. Got him swinging for the Go. strikeout. Chase the fastball up the ladder for strike three. Diamondbacks down quickly, but they still lead it 1 0. Back here in the desert, bottom four. Here's the second baseman, Cattell Marte. He provides a surprising amount of pop from the second base position. Listen, that's not something to take lightly. Getting that kind of production from the guys up the middle, it's not a strength of most lineups. Come on. And what does that do for a team when you get power from unexpected spots like that? When you're in the dugout and you see a guy come up big like that that you don't necessarily expect it, it just energizes that entire team. Swings through that one for Go. strike two. Got him looking Come for on. the K. Well, he throws him with a great fastball right on the corner. It's kind of like bowling when you think the ball's going to get into the gutter and somehow it just hangs onto that edge and knocks down a pin. Well, he got the outside corner of the plate and got that called third strike. 
Wow. And now the catcher comes up to him. Gabriel Moreno. And that one oh. just misses. A ball and no wow. strikes. There's a strike. Come on. Check swing, no and that's a ball. One down, base is empty. Blows the high heat Go. past him. That's a strikeout. Thought it was a pretty good pitch. Top of the strike zone. We're seeing more fastballs in that location. Hitters, especially with two strikes have to be ready to pull the trigger little chopper rolls foul two down nobody on and that's downstairs and outside one and one and that one two missing one. low and a two one on the way and a big swing and a miss. Two and two. Two and two. What do I got to do? The other way. And that's ah. a base hit. So a two out knock keeps that's the inning old. alive. Go in. This is Corbin Carroll. He reached out a walk his first time. That Three one's top. in there on one. Oh, let's go. Just Stop. missed. Hey, two up. Come on. Swing and a ball lifted. Get left that, field. get that, get that, get that, get that. He makes the grab, and that is that. One left for Arizona, but they're on top, one nothing. We head to the bottom of the go. fifth. The Here's the third baseman, Josh Rojas. Lynch, back to up. work. Now fly ball to right center. A squeak, a cue, a cue. Puts the squeeze on that one, and there's one down. Well, on the mound, very efficient. Able to produce an outcome, it seems like. Oh, nice. I'm picking 69. McCart in ball. the box here. Okay. Let's that one go Beautiful. for a ball. Now it's even up. What? Swing and a miss, and that's One, two, strike two. Down. Swings and misses. Picks up strikeout number seven. Chris third time through the order and a couple of quick outs for the starter. Yeah, he's been very frugal today. Economical with the pitch count. Very economical in the box count. again. Takes a strike. Oh, and two as he oh, waves two. at that one. This guy's pounding the zone. Hitters don't have time to think in between pitches. Hit pretty well in the air out to Weak, center. weak, weak, weak. Three. And that is that. Nothing doing for Arizona. Pitching change here, Dylan Tate. And he's had three days off since he pitched last, so expect him to be totally rested. Well, this was a total team effort using six pitchers in this ball game to get the win. Outstanding job of passing the baton. The next guy stepping up and getting it done. You got to give him a lot of credit because this is not easy to do. We'll see how it affects them over the next couple of days. A five three the win? Final score Come on, in this one. The Cubs go home a winner for Chris Singleton and our entire crew. I'm John Chompy saying so long. They left eight men on day. For the Diamondbacks, three runs on Ted Hicks. No errors. They left 16 men on base. Time of the ball game: three hours and six minutes. Tonight's paid attention.
All right. Two hundred fourteen Ks. And still sixteen. A five four wall. One point nine. All right. Let me check. I'm actually going to end it there. It's been your boy, MM1, AK Lunch, and I'm out. Peace.